Hello everybody, my name is Jess and welcome to Cystic Arts. This video is just going to be a quick introduction um, so that I can tell you a little bit about myself and this channel. So, like I said, my name is Jess. I live in Vancouver, Washington, which is just across the river from Portland, Oregon. I'm 37 years old, almost 38, and I have cystic fibrosis, and I'm an artist. Behind me, you can see some of the work that I've done. And um, I have, for a while, really wanted to be able to share my love of art and um, teach about art and how to do different sort of artistic, crafty things to other people. That was my dog. Um, but I especially wanted to teach the CF community more about art and how to make it because I have found for me that it can be very therapeutic. Um, there's many studies out there that show that art therapy is a really great thing to help people through difficult situations in their lives. And I've definitely found that true for myself. Um, so the way this channel kind of happened was that a friend of mine told me about impact grants. An impact grant is uh, a grant from the Cystic Fibrosis Foundation, and it can be up to $10,000 and has to be used for a project that will benefit the CF community in some way. And I will leave a link down below for more information about impact grants and you can learn about um, the various grant recipients that have happened over the years, but just um, a couple of examples. Um, the Salty Life magazine was given a grant this year, so that's gonna be relaunching. Um, I believe there was a parent retreat, CF Yogi, which is online yoga lessons for people with CF. Those are just some of the grant recipients. And so that she, she, my friend told me about the grant and said, you should really do something with your art. And I immediately thought, oh my gosh, if I had the money to set up a YouTube channel and do it the right way from the start with good equipment and be able to buy all the art supplies I could ever need to kind of make this dream a reality, I'd actually be able to do it. So I actually went to the board of a foundation that I'm a member of. It's called Chloe's Hope. It was named after um, a now nine-year-old girl who also has CF and it was founded by her mother and her family. And the story about how I ended up involved is, you know, that's a whole other video in itself. But anyway, I'm on the board of Chloe's Hope and I said, hey, I have this idea, this is what I would like to do, and this is how we could get the money to do it. And it ties into our mission because part of our mission is to donate art supplies to kids in the hospital. Um, I'm sure most of you have experience being inpatient in the hospital, and we all know how boring that can be. And um, Chloe really loves art, and so when Chloe's Hope was founded, she got some say in what we do. And one, one thing she wanted to do was to give art supplies to kids in the hospital. So I said, you know, me starting a YouTube channel for art, specifically for the CF community, ties in perfectly with our mission, and I really want to apply for this grant and see if we can pull this off. And the board voted unanimously to go ahead and give it a shot and apply for the grant. So that's what we did. Um, filled out all the paperwork, sent everything in. Um, I was super stressed out, even though, you know, they make it as easy as they possibly can. You don't have to be a professional grant writer to be able to um, write a impact grant proposal. But still, this is my baby. This is my um, dream. What are you doing, dog? Sorry about that. Had to see what the dog was doing. Anyway, um, so applied for the grant and had um, kind of an anxious couple of months before we found out 
whether or not we were awarded the impact grant. And um, on June 1st, 2019, we found out that yes, in fact, we had gotten the grant and this was gonna happen. Um, and I can't even explain to you how excited I was. I, ever since I heard about impact grants almost a year ago, I've just been coming up with all these ideas of things I could do on the channel. And now it's happening. It's becoming a reality. And I'm so excited and so grateful to be able to have this opportunity to share something I love with so many other people. And everything is going to be designed to be perfectly safe for people with CF, obviously, because I'm doing it and I'm not trying to compromise my own health, let alone yours. And um, there's going to be something for people of all ages. I'm going to have kid crafts and I'm going to have stuff for more older kids and then adults. And there's going to be things for people of all skill levels. I'm not going to, you know, try to come up with, like, I know everything. Like, there's things that I want to do on this channel that I've never tried before. So, obviously, I'm not an expert. And um, I want to make it just really um, viewer-friendly. And um, so I'm really excited to just have this opportunity. And um, I can't wait to um, actually get my first upload of a tutorial, um, which I'm not sure when that's going to be happening yet, um, but I will definitely let you guys know. So make sure to go ahead and subscribe to this channel and click the little bell icon so that you are notified when new videos are uploaded. And I can't wait to make some awesome, amazing art for you guys. Um, in the description, I will have the links to the impact grant information and also the link to the Chloe's Hope webpage so that you can go check us out, learn more about our history and our mission and everything that we do. And also I will link our Facebook page. My dog makes Chewbacca sounds. Um, I will link our Facebook page down below so you can follow us there because a lot of times we have a lot of updates on what's going on with us and we share articles that we come across and all kinds of things on our Facebook page. So make sure you subscribe, like our Facebook page so you can stay up to date on everything that's going on. And the next video you're going to see is just me talking about some of my hopes and goals for the channel. So I can't wait to get started and I'll see you guys later. Bye.